So if you make it about ego, you will often lose. What we want to do is, is look for times and prices that make sense. And wherever we can, <clears throat> go with the flow of the day, unless it's a contra time. We had a 49 and a quarter scene of the crime. Every rotation today has been higher, higher highs, higher lows. And we are getting into the end of the day, three o'clock with one hour to go. So the thought process about looking for shorts, no worries. Uh, that being said, we've said before, the idea of buying support in an uptrend is usually a better idea to kind of go with that flow. And when we get to the end of the day, that's when typically I, I start to think we need a contra. Um, we've got a fast down bar, but no traction really. So, and that's where I said, you know, don't, no worries. If it comes back to scratch the trade. So very hard to imagine that we're going to get a big trade now this time of day in either direction. And, and the main point of what I'm talking about now is do not make this about your ego. This is about common sense. Fit a very tight range, about a three point range since the news. Sometimes we'll get 10 or 15 point range. This has been awful all day long. And we're within a couple of points of the all time highs. So anytime that you're, you're trying to hold a trailer with a goal in mind, and don't let that bias you to the point that um, you can't see what's really going on. And, and right now we've had a pull back into that 49, 48 and a quarter, uh, 4875 is where the, we, we closed out yesterday. So realistically, we've not made a lot of progress, uh, no matter how you slice it. Uh, I've got 48.75 day open and 48 and a half uh, close yesterday and 49 and a quarter leak close. So the scene of the crime really is, is right back in here. And you've got to beat that on bounces. Second time through trade. Sometimes you just you're just looking to risk a couple, make a couple. And we said today uh, you'd be disappointed if you were looking for you know big moves. So my suggestion, if you have something that you'd like to to hold overnight, because that's the only way I see you getting back down here. Uh, that's up to you, but looks to me like the boys are still trying to bump this high and maybe get a half a point higher or whatever. But as we approach the 53 and a half, certainly the odds will change back to the short side. 